like, comment, share, subscribe. Thanks for watching. All right, y'all, I'm back with another flashback. This one's featuring Velvet, Venus Sublime, and Baby Ellie to celebrate Baby Eliana's birthday. This is when Velvet was back in California and she rented that Airbnb for Baby Ellie's birthday. So let's get into the video, guys. Be sure to leave me a comment, smash that like button. Guys, I have to redo all of my videos in order to meet YouTube guidelines. So thank you guys for your continued support and understanding. Let's get into this. Baby Ellie is so beautiful, isn't she, guys? And baby Avi is absolutely adorable. I'll tell you, Velvet makes some really pretty children. Happy birthday, Ellie. Happy birthday. I want to dance with you. Can I dance with you? They was lit for baby Ellie's party, wasn't they? <laughs> they, her and Venus jumping around. Okay.
There's a few things right now that Nature Boy can deny, but there's one thing that I know he cannot deny, and it's that little girl. She's got his whole face and his body, his shape. <laughs> she does, I swear. She looks just like him and built like him, too. Come on, let's go. Abby. Stop bullying in my chat before I block him. I'm sure baby Ellie is excited about the new baby coming. She enjoys having Aviana as a little sister. So I'm sure she'll enjoy having another little brother or little sister around. Yeah. 
<laughs> you would love to dance with us. Thank you for the flowers, Solar. <laughs> Thank you, Solar. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Abby is. Hey. <laughs> I want to. I want to get another angle. Alright y'all, if you haven't picked up your copy of Greatness is a Habit, authored by Aaron Dixon, otherwise known as True, many of you know him as True, he is an ex-carbonation member and he's authored this amazing read. If you are interested in self-development and growth, this book is a good one for you. It's available on Apple Books for a dollar, guys. I got my copy and I love this book. seeing Belle and the girls this happy laughing this much in a while it's so beautiful to see yes I am so happy good job Ellie let's go birthday girl let's go birthday girl I'm gonna put them in Bollywood production <laughs> thank y'all for the love feels free you seem very happy I am very happy they are gonna sleep good tonight <laughs> Those other kids are Venus's kids. Venus has four children. And, um, of course, everybody knows who baby Eliana is and baby Avi. But the other children are Venus's.
I'm curious, I wonder how Velvet afforded to pay for this Airbnb. Y'all think it was all donations? She got her supporters to send her cash apps? What y'all think? Eliana, I can't do. Mm -hmm. Eliana, I can't do. She over there playing. Let's go. Oh, she's We're cooking dinner. We started our day. Thank you for the badges. I appreciate that. Ellie is full of passion. Full of passion. Yeah. Um, we did buy a new onion powder. I don't know where I said though. Y'all yeah. be sure to watch the comments because Solar is going to be in the comments trolling and sending sweet nothings to her because y'all remember they had broken up during this time and I think they were like working their way back together because the whole situation with Yakin didn't work out. That's how she ended up at Venus's house. Here, I'm about to rinse this off real quick. The girls done took the top off of the uh off of the jacuzzi. They did. I think they got it. They said they was gonna get in the jacuzzi. I'm getting in the jacuzzi. I'm about to get in the jacuzzi too. This one even there's more stuff in here. <laughs> <laughs> Badges, y'all. I'm so appreciative of that. Thank you so much. Thank you. 
Like this? Yeah. Like this? Thank you for the badges, y'all. Oh, I appreciate it. Oh, like this. Oh, like this. right here, zucchini, I got some bell peppers, I'm gonna make this down into a, like a stew, kind of, <clears throat> make some, some is in my throat, I'm gonna be making some zucchini, we got the pots, we got the pots going, you you know, some zucchini, you said I'm gonna I mean, eat, uh, <laughs> Y'all know what it is, but... <laughs> Alright, so, should I cut these, like how I cut these? Maybe we can have some different type of... Well, hmm. I mean, I'm, I'm not... You can cut it, like, all together. Yeah. Yeah. It's gonna be a lot of squash. Now, I'm sure that now that Velvet is pregnant, she is definitely no longer alkaline vegan or alkaline. I'm sure she's adding some protein into her diet because it's gonna be necessary for that baby. She looked like it. I saw that World News caught her live um, when she did it the other day, and she looks really like she's gained a good amount of baby weight there. It's very much, yeah, that's true. Cause we, we can even save some for tomorrow. Yeah, right? so we don't have the extra, you know, meal prep. Meal prep, exactly. Behind the scenes, here you have Velvet Gabriella cooking the wings and everything in between. Kind of like that. This was green eggs. It's like I'm just kidding. green eggs. No, not that's green so eggs. disgusting. Like I don't even, I don't even know why that's in a little pig, but pig, but but you know what? We're not gonna argue with a cat. You want to know something? Mm -hmm. I, I, I'm talking to the people, right? It's actually like when I'm cooking, I realize that it's more about the energy that you put into the food more than it is about the seasonings. Cause like, I barely use seasonings, but the love that I put inside my food, it just make it taste like, oh my God. Yes, tattoos are cool. Somebody said they love your tattoos. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And you know why? Because the love is the ultimate seasoning. Exactly. That love love is the ultimate seasoning aspect. Okay, so now that we got that out the way. Okay, that's really pretty. Bell peppers, but we can put tomatoes. Tomatoes, right. Rahu bat. Yes, I'm happy. <laughs> Do I look Rahu happy? Bat. Damn. Exactly, it's so unique. <laughs> Beautiful and happy queens. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, mommy. Like a little vegan stew right quick. <laughs> but we trying to use the vegetables that we have for it.
best birthday dancer ever. Oh, yeah. Hey. You're the best birthday dancer. I hope y'all really paying attention to the comments because Solar is in them shooting his shot. Thank you for all the love, guys. Thank you for all the support in the room. We celebrate in Eliana's birthday tonight. We're going to be singing happy birthday, so hopefully you guys stick around for that or are around for that. But after we cook, we're going to be singing happy birthday. I'm pretty excited about that. Eliana's making four. Yes. Foundation arriving. Three, two, yes. Yes, exactly. And Solar got three kids. He a whole daddy out here. I'm weak. Huh? People just so funny. What they say? <laughs> Please leave people alone. What they talking about? They they just bullying people in the comments. You lie. Love yourself. When people don't love themselves, they they have the time to talk mess about people. When you love yourself, you don't have the energy. You're not on the frequency of throwing shade on people because you're in the light. So if you talk a mess about people, then that means you don't. You really. You know what I mean. You're, it, you're distracting yourself from your pain. Mm. People who are embedded in their pain body, they talk about people because they're in pain. But it's okay. We love you. We love you to life. We love you to we life. We send you so much love. Mm -hmm. We love you so much. Yes. And we encourage you to love yourself back. Yes. Remember, if you have time to talk, uh, stop, talk, talk mess about people, and that means you don't love yourself. You really need to love yourself. For real. The real is this. The real is that, this is the real. The real is that you guys watch us online. You guys watch our life online and you guys don't have the detail that's in the middle of what you saw. You don't have the details before what you saw or after what you saw, so you only know that specific moment. So at the end of the day, everybody really just need to mind their own business, especially if you don't have details about someone's life. And quite frankly, even if I did watch somebody online and I was like, oh, she's never never did that. <laughs> I'm not too invested in people's lives to like, for, to the point where I'm moved to be like bullying them and doing the most. Why? Why are you guys so invested in other people's lives like that? You know? Because you're, you don't love your own life. People who love their own lives, they don't have the energy. Come on now. They don't have the time. They don't have the focus. You see? They're focused on their own joy. They're focused, focused on their own, own life. Yes. Focus on their own abundance. But when you have black mentality and you are dwelling in pain energy, then you won't be sitting up talking about somebody else to try to distract your pain and try to distract your unfulfilling life. Come on now. Align with the things that fulfill you and stop walking on and try to create reality TV. Live your own reality. That's what is that you see? That is out. 2023 is a time that you really love your own life. So if you're on social media and you're using social media to be a troll in somebody else's life, you need to find another job for, for 2023. I'm weak. <laughs> I'm weak. How much is that paying you? How much is that paying you, bro? That ain't paying you nothing but negativity. That ain't paying you nothing but karma. Yeah, negative karmic residual. You see? I better get it together. Look. Pick your karmic weather. You see what I'm saying? Alright, I got everything. Oh no, I gotta I gotta I'm gonna I'm gonna dice some tomatoes right quick in half so they could be, you know. Um we cooking all this together, right? Yeah. This is gonna be a lot of but not that um what do you see? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll put it together. You can start putting it together now. Now, one major key that Velvet and Venus are missing here is that they are the ones choosing to show their lives, whether it's bits and pieces or life in their life in its entirety. 
They're choosing to do that. So the people who with opinions, with critiques, and who disagree with their lifestyle, they're free to talk. They're free to address it because they put it out there. If you don't want people to, you know, have an opinion, don't put it out there. You want me to put it in the pan? Come on. You can. You know, you 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 call it bipolar. I call it human behavior because one minute you might like something, and the next minute you might not, based off the circumstances. So I know somebody ain't got the nerve to be talking about some bipolar. How is your how are your emotional regulation? Do you have emotional? Let me come. All right, Venus Sublime in the building. Venus, good for Bill. I'm here for it. I should. Look, y'all. I'm not with the bullying. Y'all need to get off. I'm a little sister bumper. You okay? I'm a little bro bump, bumper. Whatever, you know what I mean? What I'm saying is, it's so important for you guys to make sure that you're making your judgment based off of how you would judge yourself. How would you want people to judge your life and the decisions that you're making if your life was on display? If you was living your life on display and everybody had access to your growth, you know what I mean? Would you like? Would you? Could you be able to handle that? I bet you you wouldn't be able to. I bet you you couldn't be able to handle that. You don't have that much love within yourself, you know what I mean, to be able to handle that. So I advise you to really have grace and really show love. You know what I mean? Because you really don't know people's lives and you're not here. So how do you know anything? You know what I mean? So last year they know you this. You guys are like interesting. Oh they want apple juice? Oh wow. Ew, that tooth though. Yes, my tooth. I bet you my tooth speaks more with my my tooth touches more wisdom than you will ever touch in your life. <laughs> Period. <laughs> so talk shit about that. That's not Honestly, y'all, Venus should have just kept her mouth shut because very shortly after this. Her and Velvet was beefing and Velvet was calling her everything but a child of God. So please, Venus, I hope you learned your lesson. Only thing y'all got to say is that the only you guys are like elementary. Y'all step it up a notch. You guys are so materialistic. Oh, wait. Hang on. Y'all can I think this might be 
Hope you guys are enjoying the video as well as my commentary so far please be sure to leave me a comment guys hit that like button i'm trying to make sure that all of my re-uploads get back into the suggested videos on youtube i have to do this big big project to re-upload all of my content in order to meet the youtube guidelines guys so thank you so much for your support i appreciate every single last one of you guys thank you trying to find a pool. We lost in the house trying to find a pool. I'm blocking y'all. That's how most of these ex-carbonation members get down. You know, if you say something that's disagreeable or something they don't like, their first solution to that is blocking you. There's no understanding. There's no shook, as <laughs> Venus would say. <laughs> Get in yet, okay? Yeah, y'all in the hot tub. Y'all in the hot tub. I see. You want to get in? You want to get in? You have to wait for me, okay? Okay. You gotta wait for me. In the hot tub. You can watch her in here. Yeah. Uh, oh wait, 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 wait. Well, I guess. Like, no. Come on, baby. <laughs> all right, let me get you. All right, let me get you something to um to swimming. Okay, come on, let's go. A come on. She said a floaty. She said a floaty. A come on, let's go put you some. Look, be careful. Be careful. No, you don't need a floaty. <laughs> Get to it. Hey, Abby. 
not gonna lie guys i'm happy that she was able to pull it together to have a good birthday party for her daughter because that's what's really important at the end of the day you know celebrating your children and making them feel really special on that day so however she did it i don't care how she did it if she got donations if solar helped her if whatever however she got the money i'm glad she got the money and was able to get that airbnb to throw this party for eliana Yeah, she does. Okay, so hold on, because I gotta get you a shirt. Do you have the key to the car? I'm gonna grab it's under the uh the table. Okay. Let me get um our bag out the car real quick. I just stepped on something. Hold on. <laughs> Y'all leave Solar alone. Leave Solar alone. Leave him alone. Okay, where is the key to the car? Eliana! I'm trying to find the key to the car. Here you go. Okay, I'm about to go get your clothes, okay? Thank you for the, um, yeah, Gwen. Thank you for the, um, thank y'all, thank y'all for the, um, for the support. Everybody who supported me over these last couple of days, I appreciate you guys. Gwen, thank you so much. I love you. Can you do me a favor? Yeah. Can you watch? I I'll be right here while I go get your bag. Mm -hmm. Ash, can you do me a favor right quick? Can you watch? I'll be right quick so I can go get our bag out the car. Yeah. Thank you. Look at her. Her be grown. Thank you so much. I'll be right back, Ellie. All right, let's go get this. Let's go get this bag. I don't think no one deserves to be bullied. Like, I don't care what people do in their lives and on their own time. But I just feel like people, period, don't deserve to be bullied. And I was one of those people who stood up for people who were getting bullied. And that turned out that I started getting bullied. So at the end of the day, I just feel like that's a negative characteristic to have. And I feel like we shouldn't, we shouldn't bully people like on any level. I have said it before and I'm going to say it again. Velvet, if you don't want people to have an opinion about your life, stop sharing your life on the internet. You're going to have to thicken up your skin because there's no way that you'll be able to be a public figure, as you guys like to say, if you can't take criticism or some stupid comment like come on now get over yourself get over it it is what it is like even even if like even if like even if it's not a bully even even if like your mama ever taught you if you don't have nothing good to say don't say it at all just because somebody just because somebody else does something doesn't mean that you should you see what i'm saying and so that's what i learned in life like just because somebody just, up, just because somebody gave me a certain energy or is treating me some type of way doesn't mean that I'm supposed to be obligated to 
responding to them how they responded to me. How they respond to me has nothing to do with me. How they respond to me has everything to do with how has everything to do with how they respond to themselves. So with that being the case, you know, <clears throat> no matter who it is in my life, I'm a, I'm gonna feel like that. Whether they did some fuck shit or not. It is what it is. Like pe pe period. They got people in my life right now that still talk shit about me, that still do weirdo stuff to me, but I would never advocate. I would never advocate for them to get bullied just because they bully me. Like or or be talked about or be demeaned. You see what I'm saying? Or be put to shame. Like I wouldn't, I, that's not the type of energy that I got. So, at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? People, people gonna live their life. People gonna live their life and people gonna do what they gotta do for themselves. It's not up to you to comment on that. You know what I'm saying? You could very much well comment on it. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, your comment really doesn't matter. Your opinion really doesn't matter when a motherfucker living their life. But we appreciate y'all, though. We appreciate y'all, and I appreciate y'all because I do know that there are people out there who want to protect me. I know that there are people out there who want to protect me and people out there who really want to see me thrive and don't want to see me go through no more dumb shit. You know what I'm saying? I, I got enough cyberbully. I got humiliated enough by Nature Boy, so... I could understand the disposition of my supporters, you know, when it when it comes to certain things that I've been through and, and certain things that they've seen other people do to me. You know what I'm saying? So I get it on, on all levels. But I would never condone. Yeah, it's open. And I don't even know if a thing is there. Yeah. Hey, you got cold out here. I know. My feet is on um, cold rocks. Oh, I'm ready to get dressed. I know. if you think that we're toxic well you don't have to watch me if you think that I'm toxic you don't have to watch me at all but yet you're still on my live so enjoy you got it yeah can, can you get my bathing suit on now take your pants off please Pizza. yeah we are here for Ellie's birthday Ellie's about to get in the hot tub right now for a couple sec for a couple minutes and then Ellie, after you get out the um, put your clothes right there. After you, after you get out of the hot tub, we're gonna sing happy birthday to you, okay? Okay. Hmm, put this on your on your body. Can you help me? Look. 
करते गाड़ी या डैड इज है ना हम फीड एंड डेवी गाउ नाउ Yeah, that's gonna. Huh? Come here. Get your foot. Get your leg out of here. Eliana, no, 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 no! Put your leg in there. Put your foot in there, Eliana. And listen, you don't have to keep crying and whining for stuff. You don't have to do that. I hear you. I see you. Don't cry and whine. You don't have to do that. Come on, pull it up. Come on. Good girl. Turn around. You ready to get in a hot tub? Yeah. You're the birthday girl. I'm the swimming birthday girl. Okay, you want to show everybody your bathing suit? Yeah. Let's see. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. 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 Let's go get in a tub. The okay. Um. You know what I first thought, y'all, when I found out that she had gotten this Airbnb for Eliana's birthday party? I was like, why didn't she just have it at Venus Sublime's house? But then I forgot Venus Sublime actually lives with her mother. So it's probably closed quarters. And I actually saw her house once and it's not that big. So they probably wouldn't have been able to stretch out and there's no hot tub and all that other good, all those other amenities. So I guess that's why Velvet got this Airbnb. Back. I'm gonna sing happy birthday. Look at you. Be careful. <laughs> Be careful, Eliana. Okay. Alright. 
I'm gonna go get you some ice, okay? Okay. And um, will you guys, will you guys come inside? Um, try to um, dry up as much as possible. Okay. To the water, and I'm gonna get Be careful. All right, I gotta go run an errand for the kids now. Yeah, find something better to do, girl. I love you, girl. Side note, in my opinion, I believe that Velvet is doing all this dancing up in front of the camera for the benefit of Solar. She knows he's in the room watching, so I'm sure that's why she's doing all this extra shit. Look, it is. Oh, 
my anxiety. The children are supervised. We have more than one adult. We have three adults in this house. Come on. Okay. Let me go give Zion this. Are you coming? Are you coming? Come on. Hey, hey. give Zion some ice thank you guys for the badges I appreciate that good job Nani good job all right come on let's see Ellie, you good? Yeah. All right, good. I'm gonna go touch bases. All right, y'all, if you haven't picked up your copy of Greatness is a Habit, authored by Aaron Dixon, otherwise known as True, many of you know him as True, he is an ex-carbonation member, and he's authored this amazing read. If you are interested in self-development and growth, this book is a good one for you. It's available on Apple Books for a dollar, guys. I got my copy and I love this book. Come on, Nani. Come on. Come on. Thank you guys for the support. I appreciate you guys. Yeah. They're having fun. <laughs> I put love on um, Solar. That's what I put on Solar. I put love on him. Come on, Nana. Yeah. I wonder what Ashley is at. Okay, so all of the children are occupied. You got the mouth Mm-hmm. Okay, someone's ready. Okay. The children's food is ready though. Okay. Well, one one bag. Is the charger over there? Yeah, one, yeah. Um, you put my phone in charge of Yeah, I'm gonna go touch bases with Ashley, okay? Alright. Um, what'd you say happy birthday, Ashley? Yeah. Yeah, I know, I was thinking about it's getting late. Okay, let me late. What time? Yeah, we, oh, you can't let wait. me go get the children. Let me go get the children. Alright. Well, I'll just wait for the place to be done. I'll just wait for the place to be done. I'll tell them five minutes. Five minutes. Alright, cool. I fell asleep. I like leaked out. <laughs> I wanna um. I fell asleep. Where my phone at? I was looking for.
I'm about to take a nice good bath right here. I need some water. Lord have mercy. I don't make my skirts, but I will one day.
right, y'all. I hope you enjoyed this video as well as my commentary. Be sure to drop me a comment, smash that like button, and share this video. Guys, I am currently in the process of re-uploading all of my content back onto YouTube to meet their guidelines. Thank you guys for understanding. Thank you guys for your support. I want to say a big welcome to all of my new subscribers. Guys, welcome to the channel. And to all of my OGs, my day ones, my ride or dies, y'all already know what it is. Big up yourself. We in the building with it.